Hey guys, Natan here from Natan eighty eight K and today I'll be reviewing Lego set seven zero six eight three Lego Ninjago Zane's Benjutsu Master. You can win stuff by giving your feedback. Which I should, but I won't. So we're gonna look for the instructions. We have the Lego Life QR code. Lego Life Instructions, some some instructions for the actual set. Then back here we got another Lego Life advertisement parts and the win. And out there we have an annoying cat. So let's look at the one minifigure of this set. I can get him on. Well, you guys already know who the minifigure is because it's in the name of the Zane Spinjitzu Master. Well, I mean Spinjitzu Slam. Okay, time to pause the video to do it. Okay, here we have the Zane Forbidden Spinjitzu minifigure. He has a brilliant design. I love the um, new mask with the um, elements bursting out. I like how all, all this glass is shattered on him. Well, ice, I mean. And I like his design. He uses the newer Zane face print. I can get this too. And then we have the Forbidden Spinjutsu. Um, face. I'm going to rate this with minifigure, um, launcher design, playability, and then I'm going to have the for the last five, it's going to be the the launching item designs and the um the wooden dummy that um Zane attacks in his spinjit thing. So here we have the launcher. It is a nice design. Some ice nice simple design with some ice triangles. What you do is you place it in and it will raise this up and I have to be really careful not to knock it off from here. I'll probably send it in that direction. Okay. So, we can't look at playability yet. Here we have the dummy that he faces. He has the nice wooden printed piece with two golden weapons. Then we have these two giant shurikens that Zane will... Um, well, you can also launch with the launcher. And then we have the Zane Tornado. So, five. Four. Five. So, it has a score of 14 out of 20. You cannot get an exact 20, but it can get a 19. So, um, I'm going to put Zane into here. And I'm going to launch him. Here we have the Zane launcher. He's ready to go. So. It takes time to get it to balance. Then you can just. Get the shurikens in. It's just. Need to balance them. Launch shuriken. Oh. It. If. So just, I've got the Zane set up. And he fell into my hand. If you play it on the floor, um, it would be a lot, like, funner because it wouldn't be um, falling off. There, I win. Replayability, 
I'm going to give a 4, which gives this a total score of 18, meaning the bus is still the undefeated champion, which it probably still will be, unless I get the um, Elf Hugo's stunt plane today. And that will probably like end up in around the same because the hidden side sets are just brilliant, really. This is my probably my favorite set of this year. I don't know. I'm actually going. I'm thinking of doing um a video favorite sets of this year. Problem is, I haven't got a lot of sets from this year. Okay, probably I'm going to do favorite sets of um this year and last year. So, I can um at least have 10 entries. Poor is a nice dragon cuz that would go to number 1 cuz that is my favorite set for some reason. So, I'm going to record um this up here by showing the stuff, probably. Write down in the comments your favorite sets, your top five favorite sets of this year, and what would you rank the set that I reviewed in these videos? I'm actually conf I'm confused a bit because I don't know which sets to choose. Oh, I know one that's definitely going to be on this list. The monastery will probably be on the list. I'll just probably just show you around and show you the minifigs of it because I'm not lifting it up here. Probably will be on the list, so. Not going to give you any more clues or things like that for the sets. Oh, wait, no, I should do this until I, before I get, after I get Elf Hugo's stunt plane, because I will probably be on this list. Yep, I'll probably upload these videos, and then see if I can get Elf Hugo's, and if I um, don't get Elf Hugo's, I'll probably just, um... I'll probably do it after. I really don't know what sets. I want to put the Bionicles on it because that's um my second favorite Lego theme. Well, it's actually tied um, in first with two other themes. This theme, Lego Hidden Side. I just love the theme. And Lego Star Wars. And we have Captain Rex there. So he doesn't like Rex. <laughs> Brilliant clone. Wait, why are we talking about Star Wars now? I'm confused.